Hey guys, Long Island 216, and today I got a review on the Case Crown Glider for the iPhone 4. And this case comes in blue, black, and red, and it retails for $14.95 on the Case Crown website. And I also had this case for the iPhone 3G 3GS right here. I'll just show you some minor differences from the case before to how they did it now. And here's the packaging that it comes in. Just your typical package and you don't get anything else but the case. So let's go ahead and put the case on the phone. This is your typical slider case, two piece. Just push, put the phone in, make sure your buttons are aligned correctly. Just push it in, there you go. Make sure it clicks because it's a little bit of a weird fit at that, but still, you know, it still fits fine. Put it in here. Make sure that that piece goes under, you know, the first piece we just put in. And for some reason, I always have to click here so that it goes. Right there. There you go, and you can see almost the same exact thing, you know, except for the the form of each phone. The, the logo used to be kind of a stickered style, and now it's just right there. Very good, I like it, it's very discreet. And you know, the different, the camera cutouts are different because of the flash on this one. And also, the the matte finish on the case crown glider for the iPhone 4 is way much more smoother than this one right here. Kind of like this one better. But let's go ahead and go through the cutouts here. Got your power button, headphone jack, which also fits, also fits, you know, the third-party headphones. Your volume button here with your vibrate switch, perfect cutout. You can you can get to it with one hand but if you got bigger fingers it's gonna be a little bit of a problem but that's fine cut out for your dock your 30 pin dock connector this case is dockable and your speakers and here they put it they added something different which I think is for kind of a lanyard you know put it in there so you can have your case just hanging you know on your wrist or something and also another minor difference I saw was on the 3G version, they kind of had a lay on the table design. On this one, not so much. So kind of a down, a downer for me. But other than that, it doesn't defeat the, the great quality of the case. You know, very soft finish, good, great in the hands. And definitely, this is definitely one of my favorite cases for for this phone right now always always have it on but some down points are it is a pain to get off you really have to tug on it to just so you can see all the pressure I'm trying to put on on the case so I can take it off but it's a little bit of a pain kind of suck I don't know, for some reason this is really, they made it really, really um, tight fit on the phone. Because on this one, it's not so bad. Just push it, take it out, and you can go. But other than that, it's definitely a case I, I recommend for the price and for the quality. I'll put all the links in the underbar down there. And thank you guys for watching. 